guys. I hope you stay in here. I'm using my camera today and not my uh, my phone because it's full. Because you guys will be happy to know that I did a get ready with me. Complete with face. Showed you my tanning. Put my tan on and did my showed you my outfit for the day. And it's really sunny today so I don't know how far I'm going to get with this vlog. Which Today is July the 4th. Happy July the 4th, guys. Y'all may not see this until after July the 4th, but you know. Happy July the 4th. I am going to get pizza. Yesterday was my husband's birthday. We celebrate. I'm 59, and he is three years older than me, so y'all figure that out, okay? So that way I can say, I, I didn't tell him how old you are. <laughs> hey, probably he don't care, but anyway. Yes, I just turned 59. This is the 22nd of this month. Yikes. <sighs> so anyway, we are going to celebrate his birthday today. Not that he cares. I mean, he don't. he's not a celebrator. Really, I'm not either. But I'm going to go pick up pizza, my son's, and bring it back so we can eat before my son has to go to work. Um, my son, that staying with us until they get their house completed, um, he works nights. So he gets up. 4.30, sometimes 5, but I, and it's 2.32, but by the time I get to the store and then get down to the pizza place and get back, it'll be about 4.30 or so. So anyway, um, we're just going to eat pizza. Puppy and I tonight are going to eat pizza, watch Hallmark movies or westerns or just our celebration these days at our age, and here comes all the traffic. I was wondering where the traffic was on this road. We live out in the country, but we live, there's a lake past our house. You go past our house on down. There, actually, I think there's two lakes you can go to. So a lot of people travel this road on holidays to get to the lakes. And yesterday there was a lot of traffic, and this morning my husband's like, where's all the traffic? I just passed several, so. <laughs> yeah, I guess they're late arrivers like me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So anyway. I'm going to go pick up the pizza, and tonight we are going to just watch Hallmark and lounge around and snack. And I've kind of eaten really good lately. Um, really healthy. I've done eggs, mainly eggs and toast. I mean, I know the bread's not good, but it's the bread that's 160 for two slices, not for one. And, yeah, it's that potato bread or whatever it's called. You can't get it at Walmart. I have to get it at the Dollar General. But anyway, I've been eating a lot of eggs on toast and soup. But, of course, the main reason is my stomach is... That's my radio. My stomach's just not been right. I don't know. It's, I think my brother's like, you think we picked up a bug in the hospital? And I'm like, well, that could very well be. Because, you know, neither one of us keep our mask on. Enough of that already. My radio, there's a short somewhere in my car. Because... I can hit a bump and my radio will come on. It's like, what? So anyway, guys, that's where I'm headed. I'm going to run to the Dollar General first and pick up some stuff. Do I need, ooh, I need gas. I'm going to have to go get gas first, y'all. I'm going to have to go get gas first. Uh, uh, uh. Every time I get in this rig, it seems like, and Cubby didn't even drive it. I guess I drove it out to <laughs> Last time I was in, I didn't go anywhere yesterday. I was supposed to go get groceries, and I got up feeling like, have y'all ever had those days, and if you're not old, then you probably haven't yet, when you just get up, and I took a shower, because I thought, okay, the hot shower is going to help with my sinuses, and it did. It, it, I got some of those blood boogers out, which I know that's TMI, right? But the hot bath, and I thought, okay, well, that will help me, you know, rejuvenize me or whatever. Well, it didn't help my sinuses, but it didn't help bumps on the road. There's a car going. But it didn't help anything else. I just felt like poop. And I sat in my, I sat down at my makeup table. And for some reason, my mind, I thought I needed to hurry, you know, but I just kept sitting there. Just kept sitting there. And I just felt a little shaky and a little just, just didn't feel good at all. And I thought, you know what, I just can't make this trip. And I don't know why I think I have to rush to go 
get my groceries and everything else. When I was working with mom, she's still in rehab. She's not doing real well, guys. Say prayers for her because she's not progressing like she should. Of course, she's 95, you know. But when I was working with mom, mom is one that she wants things done right now or yesterday. So working with her, everything was a rush. Was a rush, was in a rush. I mean, just all the time. So I guess I just got in that mode of I need to get up, I need to hurry, I need to, you know, and I thought, you know what, I'm on vacation for 10 days, right? Well, five of it's already gone. I said, I can't see mom till July the 7th because, you know, they said because she didn't get the test, the COVID test, that she can't see us for 10 days, which is malarkey, but don't get me on that again. Um, so I told Daniel, I said, I'm on vacation for 10 days. 10 days, I'm on vacation, not doing nothing, and I haven't really. But where was I? See that rabbit trail just got me off of something. So I don't even know where I went with that. Anyway, my vacation, I've taken these days to really try to do nothing, but it would seem like mom, she wanted this, she wanted that. So I had to go to her apartment, get her stuff, take it to them at the front door. And then, you know, two days later, she wanted this, she wanted that. So I had to go back. I had to get, you know, and take it to her. And I just still felt like last week I was still in a rush because I, I, I had somewhere I needed to be. I had to get a day. You know what I mean? And so I thought, okay, no more rushing. So as I sit at the table last night or yesterday morning, as I sit at my makeup table and I thought, do I really have to have groceries today? I mean, it's not like I don't have no food. No. Do I really need to rush? And now my husband was out of town yesterday on a golf trip. So... I mean, it wasn't like he was rushing me, which he never does anyway, but it was just me, me, myself, and I. So I'm like, do I really need to rush? I mean, do I really? What's the point? You know? I mean, do I need groceries so bad I've got to just, I've just got to do this? And so as I sit at the makeup table, I thought, you know what? No, I don't have to do this, and I don't have to rush, and I'm not going to. So I just got back up laid back down on the bed. I did. I had to lay back down. I was just feeling bad. Oh, was I feeling bad? But, and I don't know. I had, I had my pap smear done. I've had my, uh, my breast done. My breast done. You know what I'm talking about. That thing. I mean, I've had it all done and I'm fine. All my blood work come back. I'm fine. So I don't know if it's just I have run myself into the ground. Yeah, I mean, you know, I'm 59 now. <laughs> and, it, and it's like, have I just run myself into the ground that I'm just not moving well? And I've done that before and had to just take some days to recuperate. So I thought, you know what? I'm not rushing. These next five days, or maybe longer if mom don't do well, I'm not rushing. I'm done with rushing. So, yeah. I made some t-shirts up, put them on uh, Teespring, and I'm going to start putting my link down below if you guys are interested in those. Yeah. And um, I thought, you know what? I'm going to have to do something, a little side business or something while I stay home. So I put some t-shirts up on my Teespring, and of course I do sell Avon, and I need to start putting my Avon link up in case you guys are interested in Avon. I mean, who isn't interested in Avon? Who really don't like Avon, really? I need to go back and order some more stuff because there's some stuff on there that I really want. Anyway, so I'm just, I'm done. I stick a fork in me, I'm done. So anyway, I haven't gotten groceries. And me and Daniel was going to go today and he's tired. Of course, he was in the sun all day yesterday playing golf. And I just ain't feeling it. So I told him, I said, let's just celebrate, do the pizza, sit at home, watch movies. There's always another day for groceries, right? I just pick up some stuff at the Dollar General. So he's like, okay, yeah, that's my thing. I love my husband. He just, he just doesn't, he's just not, you know, he's not one of those rubber bands that's way on tight. He just not. He's one of those stretchy, loosey rubber bands that, you know, just lays there until you're ready to use them. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? I didn't mean it that way. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? He's just easy going. Just easy going. Oh, stretchy rubber band. Oh, Lord, don't let him watch this video. I can hear it now. <laughs> ah! Oh, Lord Jesus. You know what I mean? Of course, we're old. You know when you first get married and they're those old real tight, you know, 
real wound tight rubber bands and they just go here do this don't do this do this go do this but you know you know well, we're not that way we're the used rubber bands that just stretch to the max and ready to relax hey i, like, I need to put that on a t-shirt stretched to the max and ready to relax oh i gotta remember that guys stretch to the max and ready to relax it's going to be another one of my t-shirts going up on my teespring and i'm going to put that store my store in the info box we all need that shirt don't we stretched to the max and ready to relax and then i'm going to see if i can find a picture of a rubber band that needs to be my logo right poor old soul i'm just a poor old soul all right guys i'm almost to the gas station i gotta stop getting gas and then i gotta go to the dollar gentrail and then i gotta go pick up pizza and i'm going home Okay, guys, I've got gas, one thing down, two more to go, and then we're done. We are done. So we are here at the dollar store in my town, and we're ficking to go in. That's what we're ficking to do, ficking to go in. Hopefully get a front row. Let's just go over here and get a front row seat. Let's get a front row seat, shall we? Not that I'm planning on getting a lot, but you know. Okay, that's not handicap right there. No, 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 it's not. Isn't that the truth? <laughs> cute. This Dollar General has some cute home stuff. Decors and yeah, cutesy stuff. Nope, ain't a blah, blah, blah. Oh my gosh, guys, look what I just found. The lemon stuff. Spoon rest. Oh, cute. Oh, look at this. Oh, I love it. Salt and pepper shakers. measuring cups <laughs> oh I love this stuff okay guys I just picked up pizza from the pizza den this is our pizza den in the small town where I live in Mount Berg isn't it beautiful then they have a little ice cream and their pizza is delicious so anyway just pick that up headed home I was gonna show you my little town our little park we have a little park area I'm gonna move it over here where you can see it they have like little dinosaurs used to the kids could climb up on them but now the kids can just look at them isn't that cute and then they have basketball court yeah and we have a post office for out bar okay guys so we're gonna do a little dollar general haul i got two of these they were only a dollar a piece and two more of my lashes to put back in my stash and i got some more uh cascade for the dishwasher Honey buns for hubby, zebra cakes for my son, um, glazed donuts for my hubby, hot spicy cashews for my hubby, which I'll probably help him eat those. And then I got a couple of these, they were a dollar, the burritos for a dollar, and a box of the pizza rolls and some hot pockets because I thought Casey might want to take those in his lunch. And then, of course, I got the wild Pepsi cherry that has no sugar in it and then I got the Dr. Pepper Zero that has no sugar in it and then I got two things of water that you got two packs for four dollars I thought that was pretty cheap so anyway guys there's that